today is April 10th, and Pastor is saying to us, Cloud of Witnesses. Wherefore, sin we also are compassed about with so great a cloud of witnesses. Let us lay aside every way and the sin which doeth so easily beset us, and let us run with patience the race that he the race that is set before us. Hebrews 12 verse 1, our opening scripture. It is important to know and understand the symbolic significance of clouds as revealed in scripture. Human beings are referred to as clouds in the same way that they are referred to as trees. For example, in Isaiah 61 verse 3 helps us to see the parallel between humans and trees. We are referred to as the trees of righteousness. The planting of the Lord that he might be glorified. In another instance, the Bible says, And he shall be like a tree planted by the riverside, rivers of water. Psalm 1 verse 3. Think about that. In the same way, we are also referred to as cloud. When Jesus died on the cross and descended into hell, he brought the Old Testament saints who were waiting for him in the heavens, out of hate. They came out of their graves after his resurrection, and some of them actually appeared to many in the holy city, as 1.9 says. And when he had spoken these things, while they beheld, he was taken up, and a cloud received him out of their sight. Observe that Luke, by the inspiration of the Spirit, tells us a cloud received him out of their sight. Here Luke was not talking about that visible mass of condensed water vapor floating in the atmosphere. He was referring to what we read in our opening verse, where foreseen we also are compassed about with so Great a cloud of witnesses. Let us lay aside every weight and the sin which doeth so easily beset us, and let us run with patience the race that is set before us. Hebrews 12:1. This huge cloud, crowd of witnesses to the life of faith are those that. The Bible talked about in Hebrews 11. These are the men and women who through their faith perform great feats for the kingdom of God. Hebrews 11, 32, 33. These witnesses of faith subdued kingdoms and did supernatural things in their time. They ruled their world. They wrought righteousness, meaning... When others conformed to error, they stood their ground for the truth and prevailed. We sometimes refer to this as those in the faith hall of fame. Indeed, they are cloud of witnesses of people and everyone with his own glory. Hallelujah. For the confession of for today, I am a tree of righteousness planted by the lord i am a water carrying cloud expressing the righteousness of the lord and communicating his salvation everywhere and to every man hallelujah for further studies please read hebrews chapter 11 verses 32 through 33 king james version hebrews 12 verse 1 niv Therefore, one year Bible reading plan, please read Luke 12, verse 22 through 48, and Judges 9. And for the two year Bible reading plans, please read Romans chapter 9, verses 1 through 12 through 13, Psalms chapter 116, verse 
Psalm chapter 116 through 117. Rhapsody of Realities. Wealth Fearing. 